economic stake in us tapping in to this innovation. Um, nothing wrong with clapping about that. Yeah. But as anybody who's ever watched a loved one battle with uh, an illness, particularly a life-threatening illness, uh, and I, I suspect that there's nobody here who hasn't been touched in some fashion by that experience. Um, what everybody here understands is that the most important impact these investments can have can't be measured in dollars. If we have an opportunity to prevent hurt and heartbreak for more families, if we have the opportunity to help people live longer, happier, healthier lives, if we have the chance to make sure that a young person like Alana, who stricken by a disease before their life's even really gotten going, if we have a chance to make sure that they're okay and cured and then able to make incredible contributions uh, to our society, then we've got to seize that. We've got to go after that. And that's why we're here today. Uh, because something called precision medicine, in some cases people call it personalized medicine, gives us one of the greatest opportunities for new medical breakthroughs that we have ever seen. Doctors have always recognized that every patient is unique. Uh, and doctors have always tried to tailor their treatments as best they can to individuals. You can match a blood transfusion to a blood type. That was an important discovery. What if matching a cancer cure to our genetic code was just as easy, just as standard? What if figuring out the right dose of medicine was as simple as taking our temperature? And that's the promise of precision medicine, delivering the right treatments at the right time, every time, to the right person. And for a small but growing number of patients, that future is already here. Eight out of 10 people with one type of leukemia saw white blood cell counts return to normal with a new drug targeting a specific gene. Genetic testing for HIV patients helps doctors determine who will be helped by a new antiviral drug and who will experience harmful side effects. And advances in technology means these breakthroughs could be just the beginning. The year Dr. Collins helped C 